have another mold. Right then, welcome back. So yesterday I did these guys, it's the two uh, Roman Centurions holding swords. And today, it's like they're throwing uh, the pylums, the light spears. Yeah, awesome. So I've put um, some ingots in there, this is pewter. And it's all heating up nicely. So. I'll get this mold prepared and I'll get back to you. Right, well, I've put the releasing powder on the molds and it started to rain. But let's just carry on as best we can. So we're just waiting for the uh, pewter to melt and then when it does, we'll do a first pour. Yeah. Okay, it's all melted now, so I'll go ahead and put the clamps on the mould and uh, we'll get pouring. Right then, let's do this. This is the first pour of my pylum throwing centurions. Okay. Gonna smoke a little bit because it's new, but that's okay. Right, we'll leave that for a few five minutes and then uh, I'll get back. Right then, here comes the big reveal. Your first couple of pours usually pretty crap, so we shall see. Mind you, doesn't look too bad. Oh, yeah, it's not formed properly, that one. Back in the pot. There's the shield. Nope, not very well. And here's the other guy. Obviously I'll have to assemble his arm, glue it on. But it's got a big hole in him, so back in the pot. Never mind. We'll do again another one. Right then, the second time lucky. I've just burnt my hand by the way. Um, right. Okay. Yeah, shield's a bit better. I can work with that one. Yeah, that one's alright. Okay, that's alright. Right, I'll uh, pour another lot. Right, is the next uh, next one. <coughs> yeah, shield looks good. This is the one that I haven't done properly yet. Yeah, it looks alright. Let him cool down. And here's one where I've got to attach his arm with glue. Yep, yeah, that looks pretty good. 
Right, I'll keep going. I'll do a few more. Then when uh, when those ones cool down, I'll chop them up and trim them and see how we do. Right. So here's a couple of almost finished pieces. Drop it again. That's pretty cool. A couple here that are still cooling down. And then the idea is his arm there, where he's carrying the pylon, I'll attach it. And I'll attach one of the shields to the front there and to that one. And uh, jobs are good in. Right, I've got some more, so I'll keep going. Right, had to have a rest for a bit because uh, it's a school run. I'm back now, so I've got to remelt the pewter, and then we'll carry on. The mold's gone cold, so it probably won't uh, pour as well for the first couple. Right, so I to stop there at eight of them. So I'm going to go ahead and go and uh, glue their arms on, on these guys. These ones, nearly finished, just got to attach the shields. They've all got a shield each. So yeah, I'll attach the shields and the arms, and I'll get back to you shortly. Right, so we're indoors now. This is the guy, this is the, the two that I've just uh, moulded. This is the Pylum Throwing Romans. Uh, as you can see, I've attached the arm and the shield. I've yet to attach the shield on this guy, but you get the idea. So I'm going to go ahead, <coughs> ahead and do all of these. But I hope you liked what you've seen today. And as always, please, please give my video a thumbs up. I really appreciate that. And uh, as always, I shall see you all on the next one.